AWA Championship Wrestling. The AWA presents the greatest stars in professional wrestling, bringing you the best in mat action. Hello, wrestling fans. This is Johnny Most coming to you today from AWA Wrestling. I just want to remind you that Larry Bird is a saint. He's never done anything wrong in his life. He's got a halo around his head as big as the room. And those pistons, they are evil. They're evil. They got pitchforks. You can't take pitchforks on the court. I know I'm getting my sports mixed up, but I can't help it. I've got to talk about him every day. Every day I've got to talk about Larry Bird. But anyway, I've been given the assignment of wrestling today. AWA Wrestling. And we are going to have an exciting match here between... Red Rooster, Terry Taylor, the Red Rooster versus none other than Vader, Vader, the big L.A. Ram, and went to Japan, and came back the man, Vader. I don't know, that's enough. I don't, I don't know where that came from. I, I just I just associate the Johnny Most voice with wrestling, I guess. I don't know. Anyway, this is King Icky Boo coming to you live from AWA Wrestling. And we're going to... Yes, the matchup is correct. The Red Rooster, Terry Taylor versus Vader here in AWA Wrestling today. Vader was a member of the LA Rams in 1979. He actually was on the roster for the Super Bowl when the Rams... Were huge underdogs met the Steelers and gave them a good fight, but finished uh, the loser in the end. But Vader did go to Japan and and became I don't know his Leon White was his name and he became uh, a great champion in Japan. They're noted for not allowing Americans to be their champion, but he was their champion three times. The only non-Japanese wrestler to be Japanese champion. And, uh, he also, uh, yeah, I don't know what else I'm going to say, but he came back and, uh, became a wrestler great in the WWF as well. And he's going to face, as we said, the, the baby face, the funniest looking baby face. Well, he's a decent looking guy, but you know, the, the gimmick, Red Rooster, Terry Taylor. And, uh, they say that he got this gimmick because, uh, he rubbed Vince McMahon in a bad way and he made him become the Red Rooster. I don't know. There's various stories. But uh, it is one of the worst gimmicks in the history of wrestling to be the Red Rooster. And uh, But it's memorable. People always remember him. So we are going to have this match here today from Minneapolis, Minnesota. The face, Terry Taylor, the Red Rooster versus the heel, the Big Vader. Big Van Vader, yes, and uh, from the Rams, but got hurt, so he never his NFL career never got off the ground. Here are the numbers as we go. Well, first of all, we're going to introduce to you, first of all, Terry Taylor's manager is Colonel Mustafa, and his sidekick is Jimmy Jack Funk. I don't know if he's part of the Funk Brothers. He might be. I don't know, but of course, Vader is the heel, and... His manager is Jim Cornette, and his partner is Iron Mike Sharp. So we can see here that uh, Vader has the advantage overall 2450 versus the Roosters 2095. And you add the tag team if that comes into place. The uh, advantage definitely is for the heel Vader. And then when you add his partner, he has a better partner as well. Iron Mike Sharp is a better tag team partner, so if it's a tag team, the advantage will increase. But right now, it's 355 point advantage for Vader. And he was one of the most agile, huge, big men in the history of wrestling. And unfortunately, he's no longer with us, so we all mourn that. He passed away about a year ago. Here is the match modifier for today's match. We will roll a 10-sided die. Two, one ten side die. That's right. Here is the roll for the match modifier. It's a nine. It's strength. Well, you know that's got to 
that has to favor Vader. And let's see if that's true. Strength 25 for Vader. Vader has a 25 point modifier and Terry Taylor has a zero. Zero for Terry Taylor. So just as you would think, the great strength of Vader is paying off. Let's see what the their, their partners. Jimmy Jack Funk contributes nothing in strength. He's a good partner for the rooster. And Iron Mike Sharp contributes five to strength. So the match modifier is 30. Does, does any of the, uh, do the managers activate? Cheat, tech, and speed for Jim Cornette. No activation. Speed and tech for Colonel Mustafa. No activation. We will not see the, the managers activate in this match. No matter what the pre-match roll is. Now we're going to roll the pre-match roll. So at this point, the modifier for strength means that whatever column we read off of, Vader will have a plus one column advantage. Because he has 30 points. 30 points. Oh, what is going on here? Yes, I have to remember the apostrophe or else nothing goes right for you. Plus one Vader. So no matter what column, he gets plus one additional column because he has 20 points. Every, mod uh, every multiple of 20 goes up one column for the advantage. The man with the advantage. So Vader will go up one column. No matter what happens. Let's see what happens in the pre-match. Will we get some pre-match excitement? We didn't see anything with the managers in the first round. Let's see what happens now. It says three. Three is none. So no other modifications. No pre-match effect. We're going to go right into the match. So we see there's a 385 now point advantage for Vader. 385 is 1 to 62 for... Vader. However, this column, this column modifier that we talked about means it goes down another column. So it's 1 to 63 is favorable for Vader. Apostrophe. 1, hey. one to 63. Hey, I'm a wrestling commentator. I don't know anything about typing. I'm, I'm just plucking away here. Let's see. And it's uh, 64. To 100 is advantage Red Rooster. So now we're going to roll for the match. This is the TV match. Okay, if we go, I should have explained it better last time. We go until there's a pin or the no disqualification match ends in a finish. That's the way we go. If the pin comes in the TV match, the match is over. If the pin comes in the pay-per-view match, the match is over. If it, But if it comes in the no disqualification there's no pin, it still ends. It can end with a finish in that manner. But now let's roll now for the 100-sided die. See what is the advantage. Vader will win with 1 to 63. Taylor will win 64 to 100. Well, not necessarily win. He will have the advantage. So here is the roll. Roll, sucker! 76! It's Red Rooster has the advantage. So we go to the TV column and roll for Vader on his TV. So it's an upset here today on AWA Wrestling. Let's see what the roll here is here. Ten. That is a pin. Vader is pinned in the first TV match. Can you believe it? The Red Rooster. He did a lot of clucking. Let's see how it happened. We look at the pin. Is there a pin chart? I think there is. No, it's a draw. Here it is. Baby face pin. What happened in this match? How could he get a pin in the TV match? Huge upset here today as the Vader goes down. Here is the roll. How did it happen? 12. Heels ally. The heels ally, Iron Mike Sharp, throws brass ring, brass knuckles into ring. Baby grabs them and KOs the heel. Pin fall. Backfire. See, Mr. Iron Mike Sharp threw brass knuckles into the ring. They were taken not by Vader, but by Terry Taylor. He used them in the face of, the, of Vader. And Vader went down hard and was pinned. 
And that is it for our match today. Short, not so sweet for Vader as he goes down three points for Red Rooster. So that is it. That is all we need to know. We are going to go and, and we're going to put the results in so you can see what's happened. Where the standings are. I'm getting down there. Yes, I am. There we go. The match that we mixed, missed and did not record. We Tommy Rich won in the first round by a finish. But, of course, the finish on the four-legged leg rock, leg lock submission, he got two points. But then the big boss man in the pay-per-view match, luscious Johnny V threw salt into Tommy Rich's eyes. The big boss man used the running power slam and got the pin in the pay-per-view match. But here is a pin in the TV match. Red Rooster gets with brass knucks. So, uh, Iron Mike Sharp... Iron Mike Sharp throws brass knuckles into ring, but he has horrible arm, throws it instead to the Red Rooster. Red Rooster intercepts and knocks... Out, Vader, pin. The key word here, pin. Three points for the Red Rooster. So Red Rooster right here gets a pin. And where is he? Where is Vader? There he is. He's down here. He gets pinned. So we look at the standings up to the minute. With a lot, we got a long way to go here in the first round. We have a long way to go in this in this tournament. With total points, largest to smallest, we see that Hawk, Road Warrior Hawk, is still in first place with four. But there's three men: Big Boss Man, Bobby the Brain Heenan, and Red Rooster Taylor have three points. Tommy Rich with two, Scott Hall with one. And two men pinned without any points. Gorgeous George and Vader. And the next match should be a great one as well. Brock Lesnar, also a man from Japan, versus Gorilla Monsoon. So tune in for that one next time here on AWA Wrestling. This is Johnny Most saying, Hail Larry Bird and Hail Red Rooster, the victor today in AWA Wrestling. We'll see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.